we want to evaluate the given expression. Following the order of operations, the first step is to simplify within the innermost parentheses or grouping symbols. Notice on the left we have brackets and then parentheses on the inside, and then on the right we have another set of parentheses. The innermost grouping symbols are the parentheses inside the brackets, which means to begin simplifying the first step is to determine two minus eight. And two minus eight is equivalent to two plus negative eight, which is equal to negative six. And therefore the expression simplifies to the quantity 10 minus, and then because two minus eight is negative six, we have the square of negative six divided by the quantity three squared plus two squared. And now we need to simplify inside the brackets as well as inside the parentheses. Inside the brackets we have subtraction as well as exponents, and we always simplify exponents before we add or subtract, which means inside the brackets, the next step is to evaluate or simplify the square of negative six. And looking inside the parentheses, we have addition and exponents. And again, we always simplify exponents before we add and subtract, which means inside the parentheses, we need to simplify three squared and two squared. So again, inside the brackets, we need to evaluate or simplify the square of negative six, which is equal to two factors of negative six or negative six times negative six, which is equal to positive 36. Inside the brackets, we now have 10 minus, inside the brackets, we now have 10 minus positive 36. And then inside the parentheses, three squared is equal to three times three, which is nine, plus two squared is equal to two times two, which is four. Still simplifying inside the brackets and inside the parentheses, the next step is to find the difference in the brackets and the sum in the parentheses. Inside the brackets, 10 minus 36 is equivalent to 10 plus negative 36. As a sum, notice how the negative 36 is going to outweigh the positive 10, resulting in a negative sum. 10 plus negative 36 is negative 26. So we have negative 26 inside the brackets, and this is divided by nine plus three, which is positive 13. And for the last step, negative 26 divided by positive 13 is equal to negative two. The given expression simplifies to negative two. Let's verify this with the calculator. To do this, we enter the expression just as it's given, except instead of using brackets here, we use parentheses. And notice how the result is negative two. I hope you found this helpful.